Hey guys, Meta here. History speed run timer starts now. Okay, so it's August 1946, McMinn County, Tennessee. So the local government was being hella cringe, doing things like voter fraud, police brutality, and fee grabbing. This, of course, enrages the town's population, but they couldn't prevent it from happening because most of the young men were off at war, you know, in a war zone. But the war had just ended, so all the young men are coming back home now and realizing how corrupt and ruined their entire town is. So this is the plan, make a brand new political party in the town, run against local government, win, and seize power. And of course, the corrupt town council absolutely hates this idea and wants to do everything they can to stop it. So they hire more sheriffs, which then in turn do more crimes against the people, which then in turn make people more and more angry. The corrupt government realizing that they're losing the elections, they take the ballot boxes and hide them in the jail. The veterans then go to the National Guard Armory, take all the guns from it, and you know, raid the jail. At the jail, a gunfight breaks out, in which somehow nobody got unalived considering how many guns there were. At some point during the fighting, Dynamite blows the front door open to the jail and, well, the police surrender. With the ballot secure, all the votes are counted up, meaning the veterans won 3 to 1. 